Today, I'm talking about financing. So I get a million questions on this and people get really overwhelmed with this part and rightly so because there's literally hundreds of loan programs and I'm not a mortgage lender. I'm not a, you know, I don't really keep up on the different mortgage programs. I try to at least vaguely know what's going on, but really what I do is have solid mortgage brokers on my team that I can refer my clients to so that they can go talk to the expert in that field that you know makes it their business to keep up on every program that there is. So this video is gonna be very broad, very overview, and then really what you have to do is go talk to a mortgage broker who's gonna help you figure out which program is the best for you. Okay, so there's three primary like umbrellas of loan types. And then from there, there's all these different programs under that umbrella. So I'm just gonna talk about the three big umbrellas. Okay, the first one is conventional home loans. So conventional loan is umbrella number one. And typically this type of loan is, um, I don't wanna say the best, but usually it's the best. They have, the, they have better interest rates, they have better terms, and in order to get it, uh, you need a higher credit score. So that's really what it is. Um, 620 credit score. Let me back up. For all loans, you need to have a stable, steady income that um, you can prove. So like two years income from, similar, from the same or a similar source. So that's number one for all the loans. And then the rest of this is really based on credit score. So credit score is very important. Um, as well as down payment amount. So how much you have saved, what your credit score is. Okay, so conventional loans, you need a 620 credit score or higher, and then your rate will be dependent upon, you know, how much money you have to put down. Okay, and then really what your credit score is. Basically, it has to be 620, but it could be as high as, you know, 750, and you'll probably get better rates there. Okay, so conventional home loans is number one. Number two is FHA loans. Okay, so FHA stands for Federal Housing Administration. So basically this is the government kind of guarantees these loans to the lenders. And then that way um, it's easier for the lenders to lend with people because they feel like they have less risk because they have that security from the government. So uh, you can have a bit lower credit score. And the reason the government does that obviously is because they want people to buy real estate, invest in, in real estate, help themselves grow, help give them somewhere to live, etc. right? So it's a good program. Um, so consumers have to have a credit score of at least 500 uh, in order to get an FHA loan. Third umbrella is a VA loan. So a VA loan is similar to an FHA loan, but it's specific for people who have served in the military, okay? And there are some wonderful, wonderful benefits of a VA loan, including uh, no down payment, no um, mortgage insurance, very similar to a FHA loan, except it has some of these added benefits. And the way to get that is obviously you had to have served in the military or be active military. The three main umbrellas, again, contact us. We'll refer you to some mortgage lenders who can, you can talk to and um, they can sit down with you and go through your options. And maybe you just work to get your credit score higher so you get a better loan. Just depends on your situation, where you're at. So it really just makes a lot of sense to uh, talk to an expert in this in this field.